Conte, the setter, to get this second set underway. It's a good dipping serve to open up. Picked up nicely, then sent down the far side. Yuki Ishikawa carrying on from where he left off in the first set. Nice service pick up. Nice finish down the line. Oh, that's a good one. Oh, chalk that one up as an ace. Well, this is the worst possible start to the set for Argentina, but it's a beauty. Look at that, swerving away from Santiago Donani there. Horrible serve to have to deal with the movement, the pace. Japan quick off the blocks again. Went after Donani again, who's overpassed it. And the easy put away off the back end as well. Well, this is some serving from Yushi Ishikawa. And we saw Marcelo Mendes burn a couple of early timeouts in the first set. He may have to take another one here if there's much more of this. Well, Donani's got reinforcements back there. Will they look for him again? Oh, oh. He's done a better job this time. But they can't find a winner on the outside. Japan will take it near side. Bruno Lima, strong defensively. The block, though, can't win at the second attempt. And Japan are just running away with this second set. Yanagida, far side, faced a three-man block and demolished it. Well, deja vu. About it. That's the bad news. The even worse news is Argentina are stuck with facing the serves of Yuki Ishikawa. They have to get him out of there. Now you want the momentum to change after you've taken the time out. Let's see if it does. Oh, it's another singer. He is serving well. The initiative switches back to Japan. Far side driven down. Yanagida once again. Japan absolutely on fire here. This is turning into a demolition job. This is a pretty good Argentina team getting dismantled right now. Can't handle it at all. Well, Mendes wouldn't have been too concerned at the start of this set because his team just gave away the first set earlier and then settled. But this second set is unraveling. Losser is out of there. Soleil's in. So he has to really go for the big guns now. Bruno Lima. Oh, Losser, the youngster, yanked out of there with Soleil, the captain, the experienced player. Conte on there as well. I mean, this is as good as it gets for the Argentinians. They got the uh, they got the A team out there right now. Oh, a terrific dig, Yamamoto. That's dropping out as well. Nothing doing. Yamamoto's doing such good work. Back court. That's where you want your libero taking care of business. And uh, Tomohiro Yamamoto sells himself out every point. Really goes for it, and then swinging through there. Ishikawa again, Haku Lee, the middle blocker, looking to serve. Serve Palacios, Not too much mustard on that one, even for Japan's backcourt to take care of. That was Sebastian Solo saying, you got the big guns coming at you now. You had the young kid, now you got me. Now can Sole spark an Argentinian revival here. Club world champion winner with Trentino three years ago. Solo hugely respected around the game. That's uh, the block doing its job on Yanagida there. And, and the whistle goes near side here, which presumably will be a uh, centre-line fault. Of this second set is going to be key for them. Yanagida with serve. Nice pickup. They're taking better now. <laughs> Block point. <laughs> Ishikawa again. That's three block points he's got on his own. That is a serious cause for concern. That shouldn't be happening. From Marcelo Mendes's perspective at least. 
Oh, a zinger there from Yanagida. Again, the service reception is terrific, but the blocking is just out of this world at the moment from Japan. Now, who got that one? Is it Ishida again, or was it Onodera alongside him? Doesn't matter. I think it was far side, and it's going to be Ishida again. Oh, this is terrific blocking. The timing, the welding of the two together. Everything textbook there. It's going to take something incredible for Japan to pull this one back. Argentina on the ropes. Yanagida denied. But they get there at the end. Federica Pereira says enough is enough. Goodness only knows how Argentina are going to turn this one around. Cabana is back in. Setter. Replacing Uriate. Not much to be read into that. They do platoon at the position. Oh, what an angle. Ishikawa. He's putting on a one-man clinic here in outside hitting. Now, Yanagida with serve at 16-12. A really good serve to Nani, doing a great job. Pereira near side this time, not much of a play on that. But uh, Argentina will get a second bite at this. Oh, and they rather got in each other's way there. Options for the setter, and the option was a good one. Send it out. Well, Hideomi Fukatsu, the veteran setter, just giving Argentina something different to think about here as he sent it wide to Yuki Ishikawa, who went for a very, very tight angle. The Argentina nearly took a lot of water out with him as well. That gets Japan back in a comfort zone here in the second set. Make that a very, very comfortable zone. The ace serve zinging in. Well, Yanagida with Japan's third ace of the match. Well, it's been notably, noticeably different, the quality of the Japanese serving. Yanagida then will continue. Oh, a big thumping serve, Tanani picks that up. And uh, Federico Pereira beats the block on this occasion. They were there, they were all over him. Onodera, Fukatsu. Off the bench, Nicolas Mendez. Didn't play in the first round of matches in Argentina. Comes in the pinch hit here and we'll go straight out again after that. Yuji Nishida driving in near side. Japan staying comfortable. Shredding the block. Kraya, Conte both there. Bit of a gap between the two of them. Nishida saying, you're going to give me space like that? I'll make you pay. Monadera then. Oh! <laughs> Well, I wonder if Argentina will take a look at that just because they can. They certainly reacted as if that had gone out. And they do have challenges available. It's a mistake if they do challenge it. But then again, sometimes you just have to when you got them. Because funny things do happen with the technology. What well, is Hawkeye make of this? Hawkeye calls it as we saw against Duran earlier today. Madeira with serve. Oh, you don't want to be setting from the baseline. That's asking for trouble. That really is. Madeira then will stay until he nets. Side out.
Pablo Cre then. will send it far side, Ishikawa. Oh, this is pretty basic stuff in any team sport. If somebody's hot, give them the ball. Fukatsu knows who's red hot right now. Ishikawa's having fun out there. They're enjoying it as well. So Fukatsu then. Stay on serve. Push that out. Ooh, and Federico Pereira under pressure. Misses cross court. Well, they started off in Japan, which will give them a chance to really regroup. And regroup, they're going to have to because they're just being destroyed at the moment, Argentina. There's Yanagida just driving it down the gut to take it to set point. And at the moment, the only thing that seemingly can stop Japan is loss of momentum or loss of concentration. Ishikawa with serve. The block can't do its job. Pereira stops that. Uh, since coming off the bench, Pereira has been a constant source of points. And from that deep in the court as well, that's impressive. He goes into double figures with that swing. But it's still as many set points as you like for Japan. Conte, who's not had much of an impact, goes long. And that is as easy as you like. Well, this is a bit of a procession, this one. The first set was...